Scientifically speaking, the deepest part of the ocean refers to the maximum depth of a point that can be accessed or defined. Every such deepest part of the ocean is referred to as deep trenches. Known as the Hadal zone, the very bottom of the deepest part of the ocean is a result of plunging trenches created by shifting tectonic plates. Currently, there are 46 Hadal habitats across the oceans and humans know very little about these regions since it's very difficult to study these parts of the oceans. Here is a list of 10 such points that mark the deepest parts of the ocean. The Peru Chile Trench It is located around 160 km off the coast of Peru and Chile in the eastern Pacific Ocean. The trench measures around 5900 km in length and 64 km in mean width while it covers an area of about 590,000 square kilometers. The trench has a maximum depth of 8.06 km below the sea level. The deepest point of the trench is known as Richards Deep, South Sandwich Trench. It is located at 100 km to the east of South Sandwich Island in the Southern Atlantic Ocean. This deep trench runs for over 956 kilometers, making it one of the most noticeable trenches of the world. At a depth of about 8.42 km, described as meteor deep, it is also associated with an active volcanic arc. Puerto Rico Trench Located between the Caribbean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean, the Puerto Rico Trench marks the deepest point in this region and the eighth deepest point found on the Earth's surface. This trench has been responsible for many tragic tsunamis and earthquake activities in this region. The Puerto Rico Trench has a depth of 8.64 km and measures a length of over 800 km. The Japan Trench Another deep submarine trench located east of the Japanese island is a part of the Pacific Ring of Fire in the Northern Pacific Ocean. It has a maximum depth of 9 km. The Japan Trench is responsible for disastrous megathrust earthquakes that has struck Japan in the past years. Izu Ogaswara Trench this trench is located in the Western Pacific Ocean, also known as the Izubonin Trench. This deep trench stretches from Japan to the northern section of Mariana Trench and it is also an extension of the Japan Trench. The Izu Ogaswara Trench has a maximum depth of 9.78 km. The Kermadec Trench Another submarine trench which lies on the floor of the South Pacific Ocean, the Kermadrek Trench, stretches for about 1000 km. Formed by the subduction of the Pacific Plate under the Indo-Australian Plate, the Kermadrek Trench has a maximum depth of 10.04 km. The trench is also home for a variety of species including a species of giant amphipod, which measures approximately 34 cm in length. Kurul Kamchatka Trench Another deepest part of the ocean, which belongs to Pacific Ocean, is the Kurul Kamchatka Trench. Lying close to the Kurul Island and off the coast of Kamchatka, this trench is responsible for a number of ocean's bed volcanic activities in this region. This trench lies at a considerable depth of 10.5 km below the sea level. The Philippine Trench This submarine trench is located in the Philippine Sea, spreads in a length of 1320 km and with a width of 30 km in the east of Philippines. 
The Philippine Trench is 10.54 km below the sea level. The Tonga Trench Located in the Southwest Pacific Ocean and at the Kermadec Tonga Subduction Zones Northern End, the deepest point in the Tonga Trench is known as the Horizon Deep. It is considered to be the second deepest point on Earth after the Challenger. The Tonga Trench lies around 10.882 km below the sea level. The Mariana Trench Located in the Western Pacific Ocean, the Mariana Trench is considered to be the deepest part of the Earth's surface. The trench measures around 2550 km long, 69 km wide on average and has a maximum depth of 10.91 km at the Challenger Deep. If we compare the Mariana Trench with Mount Everest, you will see that the depth of the trench is larger than that of the height of the Mount Everest. Among all the features that oceans offer, it's the very depth of these water bodies that makes them so enchanting. Indeed, the ocean is deep and the average depth of the oceans and seas surrounding the continents is around 3.5 km. If you have any questions or suggestions, please drop your comments below and we will get back to you at the earliest. Please subscribe to Marine Insight channel and press the bell icon to get notified when we post such amazing videos. Please like, comment and share and do not forget to subscribe.